Welcome back to Top 5 Auto Repairs. Today's topic, I'm going to show you guys how to replace wheel studs. In this video, you need a brand new stud, penetrating oil, hammer, a few washers, brand new lug. First, start by lubricating the stud that you are planning to remove. Make sure you apply a good amount. You want the lubricating oil to go deep into the threads. As you can see, I removed the hub bearings from the axle. Next, get a hammer and aim right at the stud and give it one good whack. It might also take a few attempts. For this job, it was easy to remove the wheel stud because there was enough space. On some vehicles, the heat shield may be on the way and you have to bend the heat shield back to remove the wheel stud. Next, grab the brand new wheel stud and apply a good amount of lubricating oil. This will help reduce friction and make installation a lot easier. On some vehicles, since it may be tight, you may need a cutter and grind down the uh, head of the stud. Installing the brand new wheel stud, keep the stud as straight as possible. Next, use a few washers to take up the slack on the uh, stud. In this case, I use a 17mm nut and that also works as well. Next, you can use an impact or you can also use a half inch ratchet. That would also work as well. Next, tighten the lug. This will force the stud to pull forward and then it will be set. This is a close up of the setup. Again, you could use a big nut or you could use a few washers. When tightening it up, make sure to hold the wheel hub in place because when you start to tighten it up, it will cause it to spin. As you can see, the stud pulled forward and it's already set in place. Next, I'm going to replace another wheel stud because that wheel stud is stripped. It is much cheaper to replace wheel stud than to replace the whole entire wheel bearing, hub bearing, or wheel assembly. As you can see here, this is the next wheel stud I am going to replace. This wheel stud is a little bit stubborn, so I had to whack it a few times to get it out. If it doesn't come out on the first few tries, make sure to continue spraying lubricating oil on it. I hope you guys found this video useful. As always, thank you for watching and subscribe to Top 5 Auto Repairs.